you bro? What do I fucking do? What do I fucking do? Bro. Bro. You know what? Fuck you. Bro. No, what? Fuck, fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck with everything going on around the world at the moment, we're seeing some of the best of human nature and some of the worst. And in this video you're gonna see now, you're gonna see both. The worst of some of our community's biggest scum, lowest scum, and some of the best, the Tommy Robinsons of our community that are willing to stand up and fight for the vulnerable. What I'm gonna ask you to do before you watch this, watch it right through. But at the end, make sure to share this video far and wide. Name and shame the perpetrators, let's find them and let's put an end to this. We wanna see some more unity in our community. We wanna see people standing up and acting like the Tommies of our community and not like these scumbags. Today I've been in Hitchin Town Centre with my family. When I witnessed three young youths with their hoods up, being aggressive and purposely coughing in an old couple's face. You'll hear from that old couple now. Him with this gentleman and his yeah. wife. Yes. Can you just tell him? Yeah, because first of all, we're walking down there, and they, yeah, and they then purposely uh, caught coughed in your direction. Yeah. yeah. Clo how close? Yeah. Close. I saw him with it. He yes. put his hood up. Yeah. And and then we 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 called out to them to say that is absolutely ridiculous. You can't do that. That's just not on. Oh, mate. And they then uh, abuse, there was a certain amount of abuse after Towards, that. Yeah. And then you got out of the car to challenge them and, and they actually it. upped the aggression uh, mm. and uh, and then got really foul. And, uh, uh, and and then subsequently, after, as you then started to drive. Yeah, they started then hitting the car, smashing the car. they started kicking the they back, the back the wind, They kicked the back lights uh, in the car. I've got my kids in the car. No, that's my car. I've got my kids in the car. Yeah. That's what I'm worried about. I know. Kids. Now, you see when you grow up, you see how disgusting their men are. That is disgusting. Here's another witness who witnessed how this all started. Who are they going to lady side? So, what happened was your husband was driving out with us, and um, there was another lady who's got very good eyes, she's not bad. So, these three youths. Spitting and spitting in, the in her face, face. in her face, bro. Just spit no on purpose because of the virus. They thought he was clever. Just leaned out of his car and said, Boys, give it a rest. That's disgusting behavior. And they literally yeah. came over, they were yanking his car door open, trying to push him, slam him in his own car door. He held it down. Bearing in mind the risk to old people with this disease, death with this disease, what sort of youths? think is acceptable to cough purposely and aggressively in their face. We're all seeing the army being mobilised. We've been hearing of the army being mobilised. Do you know why? Because we have a society of youngsters like this. Disrespectful, zero morals, aggressive towards elders. Now I, I stopped, I got out of my car, I asked them what they're doing. You'll now see the video follow on, which was videoed by my children who were in my car. You'll watch that now. Look at you, that's no lady, bro. Who's looking for you? That's no lady, bro. You're racist, 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 bro. You're did I, why are you trying to shoot, bro, bro? Bro, get in your car, You want to walk around the corner? Do you want to walk around the corner? Do you want to walk around the corner? I don't give a shit if you've got your kid. I'm dumping you in front of your kid, man. Where are you from? Where are you from? You little racist prick. Where are you from? Me boy from. Where are you from? Where are you from? Where are you from? Because you're coughing. That's an old lady you're harassing. Shut up, That's an old lady you're harassing. Shut up, You're harassing old women. 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 You're a big man, innit? You're harassing old women. No, I saw you harassing old women. You're the big man. There's three of you. There's no woman. She's an old woman, don't get it, bro. Come the get the fuck away from my Where's fucking your car, bro. Come, come round the corner. Come round the corner. Are you alright? Get alright. Get alright. Are you alright? Hey, yo. What are you fucking doing, bro? What do I fucking do, bro? What do I fucking do? What do I fucking do, bro? 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 No. Stop the fucking car! Stop, son! Stop! Stop! Go! Go! I'm going! I'm going! Don't worry! Don't worry! Now 
hear from the police officer who turned up. You have overstepped the line in, what in sense? terms of, well, you're not, for me, mm. you're not protecting yourself. What, uh, when, when I was you, assaulted and they start smashing my car in? But, but that's not... You've gone after them. They've assaulted a lady. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you've gone after them. Yeah. Right, that's the only sticky yep. point in this. In what I can sense see, have I gone after them? Well, from what I can see in the video... I get out of my car. You've got out of your car and you've They're chased them. Yeah, of course, mate. I'm not going to let them run away, bruv. I was trying that's to stop not, them. But that's not down to you. So I should have just let them beat that woman, spit in her no, face, no, no, smash I'm my car tell, I'm not saying that. So what should I have done? I'm not saying that. Yeah. You have got a right in law, as you yep, know, to protect myself. yourself. Mate, I'm not a coward, right. so I'm not going to yeah, just stand yeah, and watch yeah, an old woman yeah, be abused like that. Yeah, I yeah. understand that. So I'm just, I'm just making it... I get it. I'm not oh, bothered, yeah. though. I'm not bothered. Yeah, yeah, there no, three, no, there's fine. three men there. I'm with my family. Yeah, yeah, They've course. assaulted that lady. She's got a big black eye. Yeah, 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 yeah. of course. How many right. kids you got? Yeah. One of them's not... They said what? There's a camera up there. Oh, that camera's got it all. Okay. How many kids you got? I've got... Three. There's actually a camera there. Yeah, can I just see your eye? Guys, I have called no. the ambulance. Can I see on the video where you got... Who watched the video? Who says, I may have overstepped the mark. Now, unfortunately, I won't drive past an old person being abused by some scumbags, okay? I won't drive past. I won't leave. You've seen, she has a black eye, okay? I won't, and I'm within my rights, and I think as every man is, to confront that evil, because that's what it is. Scum, total scum, okay? I'm now going to head to the police station. Unfortunately, I've done nothing wrong, okay? I've done nothing wrong. I, my only thoughts are with that lady, the elderly couple who just went out to get some groceries. I spoke to them. All they'd done was go into town to get some groceries. They were confronted and abused by three thugs. Now, I'll share now an image of each one of these thugs. So that didn't take long. We know who all three of these young scumbags are. The problem is, you've got youths like this now watching Top Boy thinking they're in a film, thinking they're gangsters. This man's name here is Omar. He's an illegal immigrant from Gambia who's previously already been arrested in a car where firearms were retrieved, okay? In the possession of a knife. That's this illegal immigrant. Here's the other two boys. This one, his name's Tarek. He lives on the West Mill Estate in Hitchin. And this one is his brother DJ, another wannabe gangster who lives on the estate at Hitchin. I've already sat tonight with drug addicts who they've previously, allegedly, been dealing crack to. Wannabe gangsters watching too many films, disrespecting and abusing old people. How, I'd ask Hitchin police or Hertfordshire police, if this gentleman, Omar, has already on bail for knife crime. What's he doing walking through a town centre in Hitchin, threatening old women, and then eventually punching one of them? Sick generation of absolute scum. Name them. Share this. If you live in Hitchin, I think I know the estate they live in, West Mill Estate. If you know them, share this. Their parents need to see what they've been doing today. What they've been doing, no court case or prison sentence is enough for what I witnessed them scumbags doing to that old couple. I'm not bothered about the fracas that happened to me. They kicked my car in, they smashed my back windows. My children witnessed all of that. In fact, it was a lesson to my son, who I said to him in the camera, son, when you grow up, this is how not to act. Look at these men. But I'm just sharing this. Main reason I'm sharing this is a court case is not punishment enough for this. These, those faces and these individuals need to be shamed by everyone. Name them. Share it across social media. They live in the Hitchin area. Share it everywhere. My only thoughts are with the victims of this and the, uh, of the lady who they were abusing. In fact, another, the other witness who witnessed it said they were spitting at her three days before. What sort of kids are we breeding? Anyway, share it everywhere. Thanks. If you support the work we do here at TR News, if you refuse to allow the censorship to win, please consider supporting us financially at tr.news forward slash support. We cannot do this without your generosity.